Hi, welcome to Shosa's classes. Today we are going to be dealing with least squares and some very interesting sums on them. You can WhatsApp or call us at the given number for any queries or questions that you have or for full videos on our courses. Now the two variable regression for the regression model y equals to alpha plus beta x plus e. Now we need to show that the least square normal equations imply summation i ei equals to 0 and summation i xi ei equals to 0. Let x equals to 1 x1 till 1 xn now the normal equations are given by x dash xb minus x dash y which equals minus x dash y minus xb which is equals to minus x dash e which is equals to 0 hence for every column xk of x capital x x dash k e equals to 0 now we drop the minus sign hence for each of the columns of x xk we know that small x k dash e equals to 0 this implies summation i equals to 1 till n e i is equals to 0 and summation i from 1 to till n x i e i equals to 0 and hence the given conditions are proved now we need to show that the solution for the constant term is a small a equals to y dash minus b x dash for this we use summation i from 1 to n ei to conclude from the first normal equation that a equals to y dash minus b x dash now let's see number c we need to show that the solution for b is b equals to summation i from 1 to n x i minus x dash y i minus y dash whole divided by i from 1 to n x i minus x dash whole square now we already know this Two equations thus it follows then that summation i equals to 1 to n x i minus x dash e i equals to 0 because summation i from 1 to n x dash e i that is x dash e i equals to x dash summation i from 1 to n e i is equals to 0 now we substitute ei to obtain summation i from 1 to n xi minus x dash yi minus a minus b xi which is equals to 0 or summation i from 1 to n x x i minus x dash into y i minus y dash minus b x i minus x dash which was equals to 0 
then summation i from 1 to n xi minus x dash yi minus y dash equals to b summation 1 to n xi minus x dash equals to xi minus x dash. So b equals to nothing but summation i from 1 to n xi minus x bar yi minus y bar whole divided by summation i from 1 to n xi minus x bar whole square and hence they are proved. Now we need to prove that these two values uniquely minimize the sum of squares by showing that the diagonal elements of the second derivative matrix of the sum of squares with respect to the parameters are both positive and the determinant is as follows which is positive unless all values of x are the same. Let's see how to do this. The first derivative of vector e dash e is minus 2x dash e. The normal equations which helped us obtain this description. The second derivative matrix is d square e dash e slash db d b dash which is equals to 2 x dash x now we need to show that the matrix is positive definite. The diagonal elements are 2n and 2 summation i equals to 1 till n xi square which are clearly both positive. The determinant is 2n into 2 summation i from 1 to n xi square minus 2 summation i from 1 to n xi whole square. Upon simplification this comes to 4n summation i from 1 to n xi square minus 4 nx bar square. Let's simplify it further, 4n where summation i from 1 to n xi square minus nx bar square is equals to nothing but 4n summation i from 1 to n xi minus x bar whole square. With this we come to an end of a great sum that is usually asked in many higher level places. Please like, subscribe or contact us at the number plus 9198367930769 via WhatsApp or call for any doubts or queries or questions that you might have or for full videos on our courses.